Hey guys, how's it going? Another quick update here. Uh, first off, I wanted to thank all my new subscribers. You know, thanks for following along and watching the videos. Hope you like everything. And one subscriber, WarnDog9, had a question about the habanero growth rate. And uh, to answer your question, yes, they're quite a bit slower. They're, so, they're pushing out their sixth set of leaves or so, but uh, still no signs of buds at all where my sweet bananas and jalapenos are pushing their buds like crazy. So that's normal, I wouldn't worry about it. I'll get in here on the sweet banana. I started emasculating some of the flowers. I'm not sure if you can see that. There's another one on here somewhere. Just to kind of practice uh, emasculating them. There's one you can see there pretty well. Uh, I'm still waiting on the jalapenos to actually flower and open up. As you can see there's, they're budding, so I'm hoping next week um, I'll be able to start making some crosses. I'm not, I was going to do a um, tutorial on how to emasculate the flowers, but my, I'm just using my phone as a camera right now and it's hard to get it to focus where I want it to, so uh, if you're looking for a tutorial, there's tons online. Just Google how to emasculate pepper flowers and you'll find it pretty easily. Um, over here I just planted some uh, chamomile for the outside garden this year. They're really great companion plants and the tea is delicious fresh so I encourage everyone to try growing. It's really easy to grow too, it doesn't need much as far as uh, soil nutrients or anything goes. And they attract a ton of pollinators and beneficial insects to your garden. So give it a try. Anyways, that's pretty much it. Uh, like I said, I'm just waiting on the jalapeno flowers to open so I can start making some crosses and make some progress. Anyways, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll talk to you next week.